South Korea's unionized truckers have been on strike now for nine days, but more of them seem to be returning to work. The Ministry of Land, Infrastructure and Transport says the amount of cement delivered to sites around the country on Thursday was double the amount a day earlier. Shipments of containers also recovered to 81 percent of the level before the strike. This is mainly due to the executive order issued on Tuesday by the government requiring cement truck drivers to go back to work. Officials warned truckers who refused to comply without a legitimate reason that they could have their business licenses suspended, face a three-year jail term, or be fined up to 30 million won, or roughly $23,000. So far, the government has looked into 193 companies and ordered 36 of them to resume operations.